I'm Rajem de Escondone, and I'm excited to welcome to you, you to episode three of Breath Break. I'm going to be your teacher and guide in this journey into your lungs. Now, last week in Breath Break, we covered the belly breath. And I talked about how the belly is actually more important than our lungs for breathing, which kind of goes against what you might think. The reason why the belly was more important is because of the muscle, the diaphragm. The intercostal muscles are an important part of breathing, but the diaphragm is really what brings more volume of air into the lungs. So today I want to take you on a little journey into the actual lungs and the, the, the passage of the air into our lungs and to think about how us practice bringing air, air into that part as well as our belly. The lungs are such an incredible, incredible organ. They are the place that we have the exchange of gases. So think of it almost like a, the roots of a tree, our lungs. We've got the, the trunk is our um, tracheal, our throat, the stem that comes into our lungs. And then you've got all these branches or different bronchi that, that, that stretch out. And at the very end of the branches, you have the alveoli, millions and millions of these sand, like the gr size of a grain of sand, little sacks. And their, um, their walls are so thin that there can easily be a transfer of oxygen and carbon dioxide. Now, when we expand our breath and, 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 and bring more air into that area, we really can increase the volume of gases that are exchanged because we open up that whole chest area. We go from being able to have just two cups of air or half a liter to five liters which is about mm, 20 cups. So just imagine that, that difference in how much air we can bring into our lungs by modifying it. The other really incredible thing to me is that breath is one of those automatic things. No matter what we do, it's going to happen. I mean, I suppose there's a couple things we could do so that we're not breathing, but not something we're going to try at home now, is it? So, breath is an automatic thing. It happens whether we're awake, whether we're asleep. We don't have to think about it. We don't have to tell our body to breathe. So, we automatically do it. But we also can modify it. We can override that automatic command center. And we can use our cerebral cortex, so the most advanced part of our brain, to say, hey, slow it down a little bit. Pause it. Make it longer. We can change the way we breathe. And changing the way we breathe has a chemical impact on our entire body. There is a direct connection between our uh, passages up here and our brain. There is a direct connection between all the alveoli in our entire body. body. And that sends messages, it sends information, it sends, it sends food in the form of oxygen to our entire body. And the quality of that and the 
um, the sensation that goes with that. So if it's long and slow, there's a more calming pace that quickly gets mm, spread across our entire body. So just by slowing down our breath, just by having a little bit of awareness, a little bit of consciousness about it, changes the way our entire body feels and how it responds. So I want to dive right in and we'll start our breath break for this week. Sit with your spine nice and straight. Take a few breaths just to bring yourself fully present into this moment. Letting all the thoughts and activities of this day to just slide away. So that all parts of you are fully present in this moment. And just shift your attention 100% onto your lungs, onto your chest. And just bring your hands and place them onto your chest. And without changing or modifying anything, just tune into your breath, in your lungs, in your chest. Notice the quality of your breath, how your chest feels in this moment. Is it comfortable, uncomfortable, fast, slow? And now slowly, gradually, start to regulate your breath. Focus your attention on expanding your lungs as you inhale and relaxing your lungs and your chest cavity as you exhale. Expanding, breathing in life, freshness, renewal, and exhale and relax deeply. Let go, let go, let go. 
Inhale and bring in vitality, newness. Exhale and relax your chest. Let it come back in. Inhale and fill, 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 fill the chest. Exhale and relax completely, really emptying out all of your lungs. Inhaling and filling to your greatest, greatest capacity. Exhale and release, breathing in and out through your nose. Continue that focus and that breath and that fullness. Really stretching as much as you're comfortable. Don't pass it, Don't no need for pain or discomfort. Just fullness, ripeness, openness as you inhale. And deep, deep, deep relaxation on the exhale. Breathing in life through your nose. Exhaling and letting the lungs relax in. The ribs just drop and move inwards ever so slightly or even more movement. And just keep that, keep that fullness, 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 and relaxation on the exhale. Couple more breaths here, focusing 100% on the chest. the inhalation, that air traveling down through your throat into your lungs, all those branches, every single one being activated, and those millions and millions of little tiny sacs, those brain of sand sized alveoli, filling up every single one to capacity, feeding them nourishing them, massaging them, and then accepting that return of the exhale of gases. What no longer serves is exhaled. Inhaling the freshness, newness, vitality, food for your cells, food for your alveoli. And exhale and relax those amazing, amazing sacs in your entire lungs. Such, such very fine, fine, fine membranes covered in cells that are receptors, receptors of your oxygen, receptors and enablers of this exchange. Now let's shift our attention ever so slightly. Keep that breath, keep that fullness, keep the full insulin imp inhalation and the relaxing exhalation. But now have a sense of the second breath. The breath that happens as that gas travels from the alveoli to all the cells of your body. Keep the breath slow and smooth and full 
and relaxed. Keep the exhalation complete, relaxed, let go. And with each inhalation, see that second breath where the gases travel almost instantaneously throughout your body to all the cells. And you receive that breath, you receive those gases. And you receive as well a very, very, very refined energy, prana. And if your breath is slow and sweet and smooth, your cells receive that imprint, are reassured that in this moment, everything is going to be okay. Everything is fine. Everything is sweet and smooth. You are flexible. You are receptive, alert, and responsive. In this moment, you are taking responsibility, initiating and activating an incredible alchemy make sure it's serving your highest good make sure it's serving you and healing and calming and relaxing Let's just put together the belly breath and the chest breath, the breath into the belly, the breath into the lungs. And with each inhalation, you fill the belly and then the chest. And each exhalation, you relax the chest and then the belly. Inhale belly, chest, exhale, chest, belly, inhale, belly, chest, exhale, chest, belly, continue a few breaths like that. Having an awareness of how much fuller your lungs become, or how much more capacity there is to fill the lungs when that diaphragm drops. So much more potential for expansion in the chest and the lungs. It helps open up all of the alveoli. It enables the alveoli to receive, to be receptors more fully. 
and the relaxation of that diaphragm serves to help close up and just briefly relax those millions of alveoli. So in each breath, there's such, such, such incredible expansion. In each exhalation, there's such, such, such incredible relaxation. Inhaling, expand. Exhaling and relaxing. Expand and relax. Expand and relax. Just bring your hands together now into prayer position, pressing your thumbs up against your sternum. And let's just finish this time together with a moment of gratitude towards your incredible, incredible body. And have a sense of gratitude for this new space you are opening up to explore, to understand in greater depths how your body serves you, what you request of your body, and how shifting that relationship shifts your life. deeply exhale and relax your hands relax your breath and open your eyes and slowly come back I'm so glad you joined me this week again for breath break. Love to hear any comments that you have. If you like the video, please do me the service of pressing like. If you want to get more material like this, subscribe. I hope you have a wonderful week and I look forward to seeing you again next week for breath break.